well, that was fun, but we promised that we'd play some scary games, and we gotta deliver, boys. Do we have to? Like, actually have to? Technically, we don't need to do anything, you know? Tails, I know you're like an infant or whatever, and I respect you as a person and all that, but stop being a pussy. You'll be fine. Well, I I'm not scared. I'm just hesitantly uneasy, you know? That's just the smart person way of saying that you're scared, bro. All right, all right, easy there, guys. Tails, buddy, why don't you just take a look at the game and judge if you want to be in the video or not? I, I, all right, all right, fine. But I'm still not scared. Just letting you know. Whatever you say, little buddy. Although, speaking of which, what the hell are we playing anyway, Sonic? Wait, you forgot? You literally pointed out the foreshadowing when we wrapped up our golf game. Hey, that was a really long time ago. Cut me some slack. It was ten minutes ago, dude. Exactly. That's like forever. Well, I didn't get the reference, to be honest. So I'm just as clueless. Fair enough, I guess. Well, the game's done installing on Steam. Let's crack this open and get this out of the way once and for all. Wait, wait, I've seen this game before. Five Nights at Freddy's. That definitely rings a bell in the old knucklehead. Okay, thank fucking God. Yeah, we've been getting a ton of requests to do this, so I figured now would be the time. I mean, I'm down. This doesn't look that scary or anything. All right, Bet, how about, uh, wait, where the hell is Tail? What? Damn, the kid left fast as fuck. Guess it's just you and me for now, Big Blue. Yeah, it's fine. Little bro doesn't need to play if he doesn't wanna. You want me to go first, Knucklehead? Nah, it's fine. I'll go first. You're gonna need a fearless and strong warrior such as myself to pave the way for you. If you say so. Oh, hey! A newspaper! Ahem! Freddy Fazbear's Pizza! Family Pizzeria looking for security guard to work. Hey, I couldn't read all that, bitch! Oh, don't worry, Nux. It just said. <laughs> What? Uh, never mind. Insert your too slow catchphrase here. Oh, this is, uh, kind of cool, I guess. Where the hell am I? I think we're in some kind of security station if we're supposed to be guarding this place. It looks nasty, though. I'm trying to go pick up that damn phone, but I can't fucking move! Curse you, game! That's because it's a point-and-click kind of game, Shut dumb- Shut up! The phone went off! Why, hello there, good sir. Master Security Guard Knuckles at your service. Bro, you literally haven't even spent an hour here. Don't start with that master shit already. Hey, look at these cool-ass doors. Not that I'd need them normally, though. <laughs> oh my fucking god, I missed Tails already. now, as a matter of fact, so... I know it can be a bit overwhelming, but I'm here to tell you there's nothing to worry about. Uh-huh, sure, buddy. Totally believe that. Don't be paranoid. It's not like anything's gonna pop up. Ah! Stop it! Get away! Shut the hell up, you fucking cock gobbler! It's just a camera! Oh, uh, yeah, I knew that! I was just testing those speedy reflexes of yours just in case of a real threat, Sonic. Yeah, I believe that incredibly honest and truthful statement. Really? No, you fucking dusty ass bitch! Upon discovering that damage or death has occurred, a missing person report will be filed within 90 days or as soon as property and premises have been thoroughly cleaned and bleached. Wait, what? The carpets have been replaced. Okay, I'm no lawyer, but that can't be legal, right? Hey, these are the jobs that humans take. I don't know what tomfuckery they get themselves into. Bro, that sounds sus as hell! Oh god, no wonder I've heard horror stories from the fan base of these dumbass games, bro! On god, though, can this phone guy just shut the hell up? He's the king of yappers, man. I just want to play the damn game. Hey, I quite like having some voice of experience in this game. Thank you. It's much better than just being left in the damn dark. We could have had a voice of some kind of experience if Tails didn't nope the hell out of here from the freaking loading screen, though. Wait, wait, wait. What did he say? Huh? What's up, Nux? I swear the phone guy just said those robot animal dudes wander around a bit. I walk around during the day, too. But then there was the Bison Yeah. It's amazing that the human body can live without the frontal lobe. The bite of 87? Damn, this game has natural disasters or something in it, too. These humans seem weak as hell. I could totally live without the frontal lobe. What the fuck is a frontal lobe? It's a part of the brain, I think. But I wouldn't be surprised if your dumbass wasn't born with one to begin with. Hey! That shit's still getting fixed, remember? I've been a lot better as of late. I was just teasing. Don't worry, Knucklehead. Uh, wait, like a fancy wedding suit? Nah, I think he means the costume of the animatronic robots, man. Oh, hell to the motherfucking no! I want out! Curse these immovable legs! Just get the hell up, bro! Yeah, seriously, like, 
Nothing's even happening, and that shitty paycheck I saw on the newspaper ain't worth it, in my humble but correct opinion. Dude, I just realized, why the hell are we looking after this place when it looks so old and run down? There's so many cobwebs and wires and shit hanging from the walls. Beats me, but it ain't worse than that fat dumpling looking ass eggheads room, I bet. As if that was even up for debate. Uh, check those cameras and remember to close the doors only if absolutely necessary. Gotta conserve power. Alright, Wait, bro, just says goodnight and dips. Well, Master Night Guard Knuckles will just have to proceed forward and all that confident bullcrap. Well, it's already 2 a.m. and nothing's really happening, so you gotta be doing something right, Knucks. How hard could it be? This place seems decently sized and these doors look pretty durable. Like a 8.6 defense, although it'd definitely be an 11.6 if I could fucking walk! Honestly, if I had to work here, I think I'd go insane. A hedgie needs to stretch his legs, you feel? No, I don't feel your words, Sonic. I hear them, you dumb shit. Uh, Nux, are you seeing what I'm seeing? Oh, hell no! Oh, come the fuck on Knuckles. I thought you were the master security guard, you fucking pansy pussy Sonic, pushover. that scary ass bunny is in the scary ass headroom. These doors are remaining shut, my friend. Well, what about the fucking power, you dingleberry? Uh, God damn it, I hate when you're right. Fine, but only because this game is essentially forcing me to play conservatively. Good thinking for a change. But I will back you up on that rabbit being kind of creepy. Right? She's making the same stare that you make when you haven't had a chili dog for more than a day. <laughs> oh, shut your brain cell deficient having ass up. Ah, who goes there, foul robot? Dude, that was an in-game dummy. Anyways, what's good, Shad? You came back fast. I don't know oh, what shit, you expected from me, but yeah, sup. Just snuck down to this HQ's mess hall to nab some good-ass snacks. Oh, bet. Don't mind if I do. Here you go, Nux. You can have some chips when you're done. Uh... Sorry, I'm a little paranoid right now. I'm just gonna try and lock in. Okay, so what's on the agenda then? What are y'all bums playing? Oh, we're playing this really popular horror- Wait, wait, Wadey Waderson. Five Nights at Freddy's? I didn't think you were getting to this already. Oh, hold up, you know this game too? Know oh, it? Shit. Pfft. I know each and everything about this franchise. Keeping its story, its out. characters, its gameplay. You fucking damn. name it. I'm a goddamn FNAF god. The last thing I expected the freaking ultimate life form to be is a fan of the animatronic horror game. Ah! Oh, for fuck's sake! Yeah. Goddamn, that wasn't even that scary. Maybe you do need my help if you're gonna get scared by Bonnie just showing up at the door. Shut up! It's my first time, okay? I'm stressing out! Also, did you say that freaky purple carrot chewer's name is... Bonnie? Yeah, you gotta know the names of the Fazbear gang. There's Freddy Fazbear the bear, of course. Then the purple rabbit is Bonnie, and the chicken's name is Chica. Oh, hell no! Uh, your little buddy Chica is giving me bad vibes, bro. Damn, you really are a super fan, huh, Shadow? What made this series so appealing to you, of all people? I don't know, honestly. I just like the interesting and mysterious lore combined with the unique gameplay and memorable characters. It's honestly not too bad of a franchise. Not too bad? Are you kidding me? I think my heart's palpitated at least seven times now. Skill issue. Hey, it's 4 a.m. I think I'm doing pretty decent, actually. I mean, aside from Bonnie making her little peek in at the door, everything's been going pretty smoothly. Bonnie's a boy faker. Get it right, you fucking casual. Oh, uh, okay, my bad. And Knuckles, you don't have to keep the door closed until they're actually at the doors. God, y'all really are a bunch of noobs. Last time I checked, I'm the one currently in the game and being an amazing master security guard, so I can do whatever the hell I want. Besides, one door staying closed can't drain that much power, right? You'd be surprised at how much every little percent matters. You'll find out eventually if you do the later nights. Okay, let's not get 50 fucking miles ahead of ourselves yet. We won't be doing the whole game for now. But if people want to see this become a series later down the road, then y'all know what to do. Er, I, I'm not sure if I want this to be a series, bro. Oh, give me a fucking break. One moment you're shitting your pants, but and I the don't next, wear pants. you're boasting about being the master security guard. Pick a struggle, dumbass. Oh, I don't like the way this bitch boy is looking at me. Luckily, you don't have to worry about him for now. It just turned to five a few seconds ago. You're cooking pretty good from the looks of things, Nux. Wait, wait, wait! Who's that peeking out behind the curtains? That's just Foxy. Damn, does Tails know him or something? I see what you did there, but back on topic. What the frickity frack, man? Oh my I god. I thought there were only three of them. There isn't. And also stop being a pussy and open up those doors. 
The first night isn't even that hard. Nah, screw you, backseat-ass gamer! I'm at 5 a.m. and the night's probably gonna end anytime soon, so I'm playing it safe! You're gonna die night one, and I'm gonna laugh my ass off when that happens. I hope you know that. God, I hate being the only mediator around here. That's terrifying. Why the hell did Tails have to fly off like that? I was wondering why the room seemed particularly less bitchy this time around. I guess that's the source. Man, why the hell is it taking so long? Turn to six, damn it! Um, well actually, each hour in FNAF one takes about 90 seconds, so you're gonna Shut the hell up, you animatronic-ass huffer! What? Nobody cares! Well, I guess suit yourself then, knuckle fuck. I think I'm gonna enjoy watching this a lot. The hell are you talking uh, about? Knuckles? What are you gonna enjoy exactly? Nux, the power is at zero. Wait, what? Oh God! My doors! My lights! My cameras! Somebody help me, please! Too late. Dummy, dumb, dumb. You're all out of power. Prepare to get Fazbear. Oh shit, that's it? Yeah, pretty much. Let's fucking get it, gamers! All you doubters and haters can kiss my muscular ass! Let's go! Goddamn! You got so freaking lucky there. I'm just gonna say that real quick before this second night. Oh, excuses, excuses, edgy boy. I'm just that great. Speaking of which, scoot over, Nux. Let me have a go this time. I think I got the general gist of things after watching that first night gameplay. All right, go for it, Sonic. Oh, is that phone guy calling us again? Wait. I thought you said you never played this game before. Yeah, that's right. I haven't- So then how the hell did you know that the dude's name was Phone Guy then? Wait, is it actually? Yes. Wow, originality is crazy there. I honestly didn't know that, though, to be frank. Oh, God, what the hell's up with the cams? That's just what happens whenever you catch the animatronics making a move while on the cameras. They don't have animations to show them moving, so the cameras just cut out for a few seconds. Makes sense. Also, Foxy's peeking out of his little hut already. Does he come to the door all the same, or what? Just listen to the phone, and you'll know what to do. Oh, okay. So you just gotta keep tabs on the guy. Doesn't seem too hard. You got this in the bag, Sonic. I mean, yeah, that's cool and all, but like, what actually happens if he gets out of the cove? If I learned anything about these games the first time going in, is that trial and error is key to getting good. You'll learn eventually, or maybe not, because you're an idiotic blue moron who stuffs meat down his throat daily. Now that doesn't sound like a mechanic for this game. No shit, Sherlock. Oh my god, it was sarcasm. Chillax, bro. Although, for this being your first times, you both are admittedly oh, not shit. doing awful, I suppose. God damn, what's up with that fuck-ass rabbit? One moment he's chilling in the closet, and the next he's zooming down to the damn door. Bro is faster than me on God. Bonnie's the only one in this game technically to move around the map sporadically. There's theories that he can possibly teleport. Okay, Shadow. Just out of sheer curiosity, how much do you know about this whole Freddy's franchise? Like, that was such an oddly specific thing for you to say, so I just want to know. Uh, hold on. Those things weren't looking at us before, were they? Well, that's an uncommon Easter egg you just got, Sonic. So no, no, they were not always looking at your zesty ass. Shut the fuck up, gray bitch boy! But to answer your question, Knuckles. It isn't too much, but I know most of the deep, dark lore. The theories that were headed by Game Theory MatPat and whatnot. The characters and their functions. I know the fucking horrendous ass things that are posted in the community that somehow rival the levels of sheer cringe and touch grass energy that the Sonic community emits. Oh, and I've watched the movie that came out last year and plan to watch the sequel. What the fuck? Oh, goddamn, there's Bonnie again. Is he like the grunt of the band or what? I think some of these other fat fucks move faster than him on harder nights. But yeah, he's like a zoomy puppy on crack most of the time. And those crashing noises on this broken cam, that's gotta be Chica, right? Sorry I had to take a second for how oddly not dumb you're acting right now, Faker. But yes, that's also correct. That cam is a good tool to use to gauge if Chica's close to the door or not. Man, I'm not gonna lie, Shadow. You're much better of a guide for this game than that phone guy and his stuttery bullshit. Yeah, what the hell happened? Weren't you literally gloating about raking us over the coals in golf a little while ago? Look, fellas, I'm somehow burned out after throwing so much shade that y'all wouldn't be seeing the fucking sun in years. Shadow Gens is literally less than a week away at this point. I just want to be Mellow Shadow for now. Honestly? Mood. 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 Newspaper! No, what? what the what hell, the fuck? man? Huh? Sonic, that was a zesty ass noise, bro. What the hell? First off, shut the hell up, knucklehead. Secondly, Foxy's out of the fucking cove. 
And thirdly, why the hell did you yell newspaper edge hog? Oh, it's cause you got another Easter egg, where the rules sign turns into an article that reveals some lore, but you missed it. Speaking of which, the fucking backstage heads are peeking at me again. Damn, Sonic! You sure you ain't a bunny? Cause you're racking up those Easter eggs like a professional! Yeah, yeah, very clever knucklehead. So what lore did that article say anyway? I didn't even notice that shit changed. Luckily for you, Team Sonic dweebs, I basically have photographic memory, so I remember exactly the one you got. Here I just pulled it up on my phone. Take a look. Bro, you literally just screenshotted the fucking video. What you even talking about, bitch? Stop it before the fourth wall crumbles and I'm forced to actually kill myself. Local pizzeria set to close by year's end. After a long struggle to stay in business after the tragedy that took place there many years ago, Freddy Fazbear's Pizza has announced that his will close by year's end. Despite a year-long search for a buyer, companies seem unwilling to be associated Bruh. with the company. These characters will live on. In the hearts of kids, these characters will live on. Uh, wait, I have many questions. Yeah? Well, get in freaking line, man. Wait, what do you mean? I thought you were the expert in this field of animatronic bears. Well, would That's you believe me if I said there's still that, a very bro? high chance that despite this game being out for over a decade now, there's still mysteries that are unclear or haven't been solved at all. Honestly, with how batshit crazy you are for these games, I wouldn't be surprised in the slightest, bro. I'm still confused, though. What tragedy took place? And are we guarding a closed-down pizzeria? What's the fucking point of that? Well, to figure all that out and more, you'd have to play the games that followed after this one. How many games are there anyway? Well, there's currently 10 mainline games, two of which are VR specials, five spin-off titles, not counting that defunct-ass AR game. Oh, and about 23 books that are very much dubiously canon. Yeah, fuck that, I ain't playing all that shit. Hey, I'm kinda curious. Although it all depends on if people want a full-on Freddy series. Once again, Y'all know what to do if you want to let us know. There ain't no way people want to see this ten times over. Uh, I kind of do. Yeah, well nobody asked you, you fucking chode licker. Jesus, I try to be cool for once and I'm catching 3,000 strays. Yeah, hedgehogs are like fucking baskets for strays for some reason. Holy shit, the fox has returned to our humble abode! Uh, yeah. Hey guys. Fuck Sorry off, Sorry for giving out on you. I just had to do some research for a little bit. What were you researching? Well, I was actually researching some mechanics Let's about get how it, this baby. game Nicely works. done. And I believe I've come up with the best strategy to where I'd stay alive and not get scared or anything. Uh, not that I was scared in the first place. Oh, that's definitely fucking Cap if I've ever heard it. It's not Cap Edge Hedge. Sonic, let me play. I'll show you that I can play horror games good. All right, all right. You got it, little bro. Just don't freak out if whatever you got doesn't work. Yes, let me cook, boys! Well, I can't help but be slightly curious as to what your so-called ultimate strategy is going to be for a game you've never played before. Well, after watching exactly one video from some guy on YouTube, think his name was Market Pillars or something, I realized that the animatronics only attack you if you flip up your camera. So as long as I don't look at the cameras too much and instead focus on the doors, I'll minimize power consumption while keeping them out. Hey, that doesn't sound like a bad idea little buddy. At least I think, I don't know, that just sounded like a bunch of nerdy bullshit, but I'm not one to judge. <laughs> bro, why are you chuckling like an actual predator, bro? Yeah, that was weird as hell, man. Oh, no reason. Carry on, Tails. That strat is ultimate life form certified. There we go. I knew I was onto something. 2 a.m. and still have over half power. Glad my calculations are turning out right. And you still haven't shit your pants out of fear. I'm surprised, honestly. I don't know, guys. I, I don't have a good feeling about this for some reason. I mean, he looks like he knows what he's doing, and that's usually a good thing. Yeah, don't sweat it, big bro. I'll be totally fi- Wait. Oh, no. That there fox it is. Guy go? Uh oh. Oh, Jesus. What the fucking fuck? Oh, ah! shit. Goddamn, that got me. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Shadow, <laughs> <laughs> oh, stop laughing. Oh. Ah! Shut the fuck up, dude! Never again! Never ever again! I hate these stupid bum-ass horror games scaring the fuck out of me! I'm getting a mint! Welp, that made my fucking week, I'll say. Yeah, I bet it did. Although I can't say that didn't get me good, too. I mean, we didn't do too bad, huh? Got to night three! That's basically half. Oh, you poor naive little soul. What? Nothing I didn't say anything, dummy dumberson. Whatever. That's enough cryptic bullshit both in and out of the game for one day. Hope you guys liked this, though. I know it's been highly requested, and again, if you want to see more Freddies, let us know. But I think it's time to get ready for a certain highly anticipated game that features yours truly. Oh god, we're gonna have to play as you for a couple hours. Yuck! Shut up and fuck off, you endangered species having ass!
And here's a shout out to our epic members, Goofball Sonic, B is Bonkers 22 Lawrence, Joshua Andrew, Alice the Hedgehog, Jalen Wilkes, I'm a Tree, Bam, Just Johns, Mossy87, Swifty Boy, Mevins2001, XCyber8, Celestine, SonicFan5340, Infinite the Jackal Productions, J Ragland, Akeem, Little Happy Puffer, Cavion Matthews, Juan C. L. Knight and Ark, Fireski 15, The Big Goobers, The Derp, Tanushi, Cars Fan, Nosquick, Connor, Master Gamer, Accordion Yggdrasil, Ellie and Joel Forever, Ace Asterio, Mr. Megamat X, The Crisp, Just Some Guy 420, Bear 295, Awkward Info, J and D Classics, Tudor Manguta, Matamitis 8503, D4CH34T, Yoshivorus 25, FFCM15, Raquel Gomez, Money Dynamic Matanya, and finally, Uzuka Scarlaboshi. Stay safe and take care, everyone.